Hey, you guys. In this video, we are going to be tapping and scratching and organizing through an art supply shop here in an area close to me in Egypt. As you can hear, there's people in the shop talking and that will be the case throughout the video. But hopefully it will become kind of a background sound as I organize some of these different, I don't know, these look like some kind of paint pen to me but I'm not sure. So, uh, my friend who's been helping with uh, tap throughs in different stores here, she's like talking to the people that work here and connecting with them because they've been so kind to let us film. I'm just like flipping these around so they're all facing the same direction. This rose, like all greens, blues, turquoises, aquas, and some deeper blues, pebbles. It was always my uh, dream when I was in the US to do a walk through, tap through, organizing, etc., through an art store or craft store that did not have music playing. And um, so, even though we have people talking, we, we've got one step in the right direction. There is no music playing. So the language that we hear being spoken is Egyptian Arabic, or um, it's called Ameya. Ameya is um, like the dialect of, of Arabic spoken in Egypt. So there's like formal Arabic which is um, kind of like what you hear in the news but then each country actually has like their own dialect of Arabic so if you're in Lebanon you're going to speak Lebanese Arabic if you're in Morocco, Mor Moroccan Arabic and there's influences um, from a few different languages in some different countries as well like in Morocco French is spoken as well, so people will be speaking French and Moroccan Arabic there often. So this shop is actually two stories. I'm just going to be on the first floor. it was quite large even on the bottom alone but maybe one day we can go back and film like on the, the top floor some different paints they really had tons and tons of art supplies. There's actually like a school just down the street from this shop that's like an arts school 
And I often see students walking around with like... I can't remember if there's a specific name like portfolios. I don't know, like when you when you see artists with like those large black thin kind of like briefcase type bags. And they've got I think like artwork and things in them. And I see this often here, so I assume that the students purchase lots of their supplies here. I believe this is just acrylic paint. Yeah. When I was painting a lot, I used acrylic. I like acrylic the most. I like really vibrant, um, more like decor pieces, like when I paint things. So I really like acrylic paint. I like how fast it dries. And I like the bright colours and even the thickness of it, I just like it. This guy was getting stuck. <laughs> I couldn't quite get it, so these were like all at a weird angle and like all of them were like falling forward. So I was kind of more picking them up versus organizing. It was more just like standing them up. Have any of you guys ever watched the channel Southern ASMR? with Mary. Hilarious. She is hilarious. And um, she does lots of like store organization videos. So if you like this, I would definitely check out her channel. There's tons of them. I haven't watched her channel for a while, but I used to watch her organization and walkthrough videos a lot. I should go back to that. You know how sometimes you just, you forget about channels? Like you just like watch them for a long time and then you kind of find something you like and you're like, oh my gosh, I've watched Mary's channel for so long. I've got to, got to go watch some of her videos. Her fa my favourites are hers are walkthroughs. And she does, yeah, mostly organising. She doesn't really, as far as I remember, she didn't do a ton of tapping and scratching, just tucking and organising. She's a uh, southern accent, hence the name of the channel. And she's hilarious. She's like really blunt <laughs> to the point. Super funny. Do you guys know any other channels that do like organizing through shops? If you do, I'd be curious. Because I, I love videos like this. I guess I haven't come across any others besides Mary's. I mean, once in a while, like, people organise something, but it's not really like the whole video is. And this one's also not entirely organising. Of course, I'm scratching and tapping too. Is. By the way, if 
you haven't noticed already, this is a voiceover. This is the talking version of this video. There's a no talking version as well. If you prefer that or if you like them both. I think it's so fascinating how we all have like different inclinations, things that we like, they give us tingles, that relax us. I'm like a talking person. Love the talking videos. Asian without talking isn't as effective for me. It's amazing. Don't know what you think, but I love the talking videos. The new channel. After I'm just like laughing at myself right now because of the sentence I just said, like. I love the talking videos and I just like talking, 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 talking. <laughs> Sounds like I'm just saying I love talking. Yeah, you know. I do love chatting with you guys, that's for sure. I just, I just chatted up the whole time. I guess there's some kind of like suction cups that you can like hang things on. Got all the paintbrushes over here. Lots of different sizes, widths and lengths and we've got everything. I do not know much about paint brushes. Or like what they're all used for in different ways. When I say I did painting it's like, I actually did it for quite a few years actually but it's just like, I was just designing things like I was not. Well, anything I was doing, I was just doing it for enjoyment, and I did some of them actually, but um, it was just really fun, and I wasn't good at it, honestly. I just am good at like colours and decorating, but I didn't have any actual like real painting skills, just more design, I think, design elements. years now ago, five years ago, I put out a video that was me painting, or like putting together an art piece, I should say. There's a little series called ASMR in real life, it's just kind of doing everyday things, little activities, and it just kind of gives you tingles to watch. Well, that's an amazing sound. I mean, so good. I am trying so hard to find a bookstore that will let us film. And I've got turned down by two so far. Just because like, they're owned by someone who's not like, working in the store at the time. And I think the other one's like maybe a larger store where we needed to get permission from the owner where there's lots of these smaller stores where you can just ask and the manager's there and they're like, yeah, sure, go for it but I really want to do a bookstore I'm hoping I can find a store that would be willing to let us do that Any of you guys, artists, painters, any kind of like art that's been shown in this video at all, any crafting? What do you paint with? I'm so curious. If you paint, what kind of paint do you like the most? Seeing what people can do with oil paints. Unbelievable. I'm 
just a bunch of like markers and things for kids here. Some pencils, crayons. Let's organize this section for a moment. I love all the colors in this shop so much. So, as we approach the end of this video, I just want to say thank you so, so much for watching. If you've made it to the end of this video, I haven't done this for a while, but if you've made it to the end, I'm going to give you a random emoji to put in the comment section below. Um, I want to go with a rainbow because I just feel all the colours right now. So if you've gotten to the end of this video, let's go with a uh, double rainbow, two rainbows in the comment section. That's all you have to put. You don't have to write anything else and I'll know that you made it to the end of the video with me. I'll double rainbow it. These were like pretty organized actually. I was kind of wishing they were more messed up, but they were super organized for the most part. Okay, so thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed. Um, it seems like from the no talking version, it seems like you guys really liked the organizing idea. I'll try to do that in some other videos if there's stores I come across that I can do that in. Like where the setup where organizing is, is needed in some way and the store owner is like comfortable with that. for watching hope you enjoyed and i hope you have a great rest of your day or night and it was relaxing for you that's a bit loud <laughs> so yeah lots of post board there's some few other things upstairs but we'll go ahead and say goodbye for now and maybe we'll come back for the second floor sometime Okay, just one more thing, yeah, alright you guys, bye for now. <laughs>